Hi guys, welcome back to free advertisements for whatever company is on the edge of my screen right now. <laughs> I don't know. But we are back with Sporkle Quizzes, guys. And we're on our penultimate continent. The countries of South America. Can you name the countries of South America? There's only 12, so I, I hope so. <gasps> but like I said I'm uh, in the last video, I'm terrible with the Caribbean. I'm not great with South America, and I've been thinking about this. I think the reason for it is, when you're in the UK, you get a lot of news from Europe, right? When you're looking at the news and stuff. A lot of it's about Europe. A lot of it, predominantly most of it's about North America, about America. Specifically the USA, because we just copy whatever they're doing. And um, But we also get a lot of news from Asia. But we hardly ever cover the Hispanic world. Cover, like, um, the sort of South America... Parts of the Caribbean and Central America. It's, it's hardly ever covered uh, in the news or in the media in the UK. So you never really get that reinforcement of that's a country or that's the capital, for example. So I'm a lot worse at these. Uh, but let's let's start then. The countries should be quite easy. I, I, I'll be fine with the countries. So that's Argentina. We have Chile next to it. Um, now, this small one here, I always get mixed up. But I think that's Uruguay. Know that from rugby. And then Brazil is here. Of course, the big one. Paraguay there. Not actually next to Uruguay. Close, though. Bolivia in the middle. Named after Bolivar. Uh, we have Peru. Uh, Ecuador. Colombia and Venezuela. And then we've got the two small ones. Uh, Venezuela. And this is actually French territory, this here. Which, uh, in case you don't know, a bit of trivia for you guys. The largest land border that France has is with Brazil. Here. On that little uh, little bit of land there. Which is crazy, really, when you think about it. Um, that's bigger than the border between France and Spain or Ger France and Germany, for example. It's huge. Just shows you the scale of South America. Um, Argentina, I believe, if you laid it sideways over Europe, it would go from London to Turkey, I believe. It's that big. Massive. Massive countries. Um, but we have Guyana here. And Surin Suriname? I don't know how you say it. Suriname? 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 That's it. Oh, buzzing. 100%. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. But capitals and flags might be a different question. So uh, <laughs> there is only 12, though. So it's not too hard. But um, we'll see. I'll move on to the flags, guys. We'll see you in a second. Well, here we are then, and let's play. Nope. <laughs> Uruguay, very distinctive flag. That is Chile, right? Yeah. Now we have Argentina here, Brazil here. Now this is where the going gets a little bit tougher. I think this one is Peru, I'm pretty sure. So we just got to, it's like process of elimination right now. That's Colombia. Colombia? No, it's not. One of these is Colombia with the same. No. Right, well, uh, <laughs> I guess process of elimination must be that one. <laughs> is that Venezuela then? Uh, one of these is Venezuela. I can't remember which one. Venezuela. Yes, okay, we got that one right. Uh, who do we have left then? We have Bolivia. We have Paraguay. It's just going to be process of elimination. I, I don't actually know. Um, we have Ecuador. So we got one, two. We got five left. So we got Suriname, Guyana. I'm going to guess these two are Suriname and Guyana because I haven't seen those before. So that's Suriname. I'm thinking this is Guyana then. Yeah. It's always the smaller nations that you've not really heard a huge amount about that have the really funky and cool flags. Like, why is that? Like, Nepal's flag is, is awesome. Like, why why is that? Um, so, we have... I think that would be Paraguay. Yes. So, who do we have left? We have Bolivia and Ecuador. I would say that is Bolivia. No, really? So, Ecuador, yes, and then Bolivia. I can type okay today. Okay. 
100% again. That's decent. We're doing all right, guys. We're doing all right. We're doing all right. Capitals, on the other hand. Um, that might be like a 2 out of 12. <laughs> so, let us see. Let us see. <laughs> and I'll see you in a second, guys. Here we are with the Capitals of South America. And let's go. Buenos Aires. I don't know how you spell that. Um, I'm sorry. Buenas. Buenas Aires. Buenas Aires. <laughs> I don't know. I'm pretty sure that's right. Oh, well. Uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, no. Oh. Um... Is that like San Sebastian or something like that? Or is that Peru? I think that's Peru. Okay. Yes. Woo! Yes, we've done one. Oh. <laughs> oh, Bogota. I know that one. Okay. Uruguay. Um, San Sebastian. San... Oh. Uh. Um, Bolivia City, Bolivar, <laughs> oh no, oh, I, I don't know how, Buen, Buenos, is it Buenos, okay, it's Buenos, okay, good, uh, three, we've got three, I I used to know Chile and I it's just gone. It's just gone. This knowledge has not been retained. <laughs> Chile, Chile, Chile. Oh, it's it's a simple simple, I'm pretty sure. I could I should know Venezuela. What is Venezuela? I uh, that's it. That's me done, guys. Uh, Caracas, okay. Georgetown for Guyana, I didn't know that. Paramaribo for Suriname, I didn't know that. La Paz for Bolivia. Asuncion for Paraguay. Montevideo for Uruguay. Santiago for Chile. Lima for Peru. And Quito for Ecuador. I mean, out of those, I should have known Santiago and Lima. The rest of them, take it or leave it. Caracas for Venezuela, probably. Average score, 83. Really? I feel like there's been some cheating there, but I'm not going to lie. <laughs> But seeing as it's such a short video, guys, let's do some trivia on South America. Let's see whether we can find another cool quiz on South America and keep it going. Right, guys, we have a tic-tac trivia of South America. Only two and a half minutes. Uh, but we have to enter in the digits of that we believe are the true... The true statements. So, number one, let's go through these one by one. Dutch, Portuguese, and German are official languages... In at least one South American country. Well, Portuguese is, of course. Dutch would likely be Guyana. I don't think German would be, so I don't think that's right. The flag of Suriname features three yellow stars. It could do, but I can't remember already. <laughs> the Straits of Magellan separates mainland South America from Tierra del Fuego. Oh, I don't know. Uruguay is a larger in area than Guyana. I don't think that's true. South America's largest city is Sao Paulo. Mm. Aconcagua in Argentina is the highest mountain outside of Asia. Would that be true? Is there any mountains in the Rockies higher? I think that would be true, you know. I think so. I think six so far, I think six is true. And four potentially could be true, and so could one, and so could three. Oh, great. Uh, the Orinoco, Chari, and Limpopo rivers. No, that's uh, the Orinoco and Limpopo are definitely in Africa. I'm not sure about Chari. The Nazca Lines are located in Peru. I believe that to be true. Brazil borders every South American country except Chile and Ecuador. Well, okay. So I think six is true. 
six. Eight. And nine. Uh, six? Oh, we've done that. Eight. Nine. Well, I don't... What happens if I just keep pressing, like... It doesn't... What happens? Oh, whatever. Let's just show us the answers. Which one's true? Which ones are true? Oh, well. Oh, well. Let's find another trivia one, guys, because that's... It's not quite as good, but I'll see you on another trivia one in a second. Here we are, guys. A standard quiz. It's multiple choice, though, so it should be a little bit easier. And only nine questions and only three minutes. Which is the only country in South America that has a coastline on both the Pacific Ocean and the Caribbean Sea? That would be Colombia. Which of these countries drives on the left? Guyana? Yep. Which is the only country in the world whose national flag has different emblems on each side? I don't think it's Brazil or Argentina. Let's go for... It was Paraguay. Oh, cool. Fortaleza is a city in which South American country? I don't know. Brazil, apparently. The currency of which country is called the Bolivar Fuerte? Let's go for Bolivia. Really? Venezuela. Easter Island belongs to which country? I'm going to say Chile. Yeah. Uh, in which country is English the national language? Guyana. The former president of which country famously declined to live in the presidential palace and donated 90% of his, charity, uh, his salary to charity? Let's go for Argentina. I, that was a guess. The Camino de las Yungas Road, known to be the most dangerous in the world... 200 to 300 fatalities. I think that's in Peru. Oh, no, it's Bolivia. Oh, well, we got four out of nine. That's pretty hard. But anyway, guys, um, I hope you've enjoyed this video. How did you do playing along? Comment down below how you did. And uh, I'll see you on the next one where we're going to take on the final uh, continent, Oceania. Another difficult one. We saved the hardest till last, didn't we? We saved the hardest till last. But anyway, I'll see you on the next video, guys.